Let's go to Joseph, who's an Arsenal fan. Joseph, good evening. Good evening. Thanks very much. Uh, nice to talk to you. Yeah, I was just going to say that I'm sort of glad that we stuck with Arteta. I don't, you know, take much from tonight. It was a bit of a reserve team on both sides. But generally, he's a very young manager. Um, we've definitely had some shocking performances. But I do think, you know, he is starting to build something. Uh, probably a, it's taken a little bit longer than I thought. But I do think there's some signs now. And actually, you know, there's three fantastic teams in this league. But I really think there's not much in it between the next five or six teams. And so there is, you know, Champions League, certainly Europa place up for grabs if we can you know, get some well, consistency. I, I was, you know, at, at the start of the season, everyone was saying the top four is, is done and dusted. But Manchester United have, uh, are in a bit of, uh, I mean, dire straits at the minute in terms of their performances, the way they're playing with the manager, everything about them. I mean, West Ham currently sit fourth on 17 points. Arsenal are 10th on 14 points. So there's only three points between 10th and 4th place. I mean... Is Champions League a, a, a realistic proposition for Arsenal this season? Joseph? As, as a no. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Are you still... It just cut out there. Sorry. Can you hear me? Yeah, go yeah, on. Did you, did you hear the question? I, I, I basically said, is, uh, is top four a realistic proposition for Arsenal this season? You're 10th on yeah. 14 points, but West Ham are fourth with 17. Yeah, I mean, I, I think we'll. I, I don't. I think it's realistic. I don't think we'll get there. I think player for player, I think you have to say Man United, although they are struggling, you know, uh, at the moment. You know, they are a better squad, a significantly better squad than us. But, um, but so I, I think it is realistic. I don't think. I think we'll fall a little bit short. But I'm thinking, you know, fifth or sixth, and I think that will be fine. And then the ne next year, I think we really have to get in the Champions League. Mm. Oh, uh, just uh, Joseph on Enketio. He's in the last year of his contract. Got two goals tonight. Played very well. Uh, you want to keep him? Is it someone that Arteta needs to get, you know, stay on board? Yeah, I, personally, I don't think so. I think he's he's not he's not quite the standard we need. But we are going to be desperately looking for a, a top quality striker because I don't think that is it. You know, he's only twenty two though, Joseph. Twenty two. He's still got um, still got a lot to learn. You know, he's got something yeah. about him. Scores goals. Yeah, I just think for for a team that wants to you know compete and be in the Champions League, I, I don't think he's quite at that level. You know, he sniffs the goal, but. His all-round game, I don't think it's, it's quite a little. Personally, I'd, you know, I, I may be wrong, but that's my idea. Are you, are you fully behind Arteta, Joseph? I, I am, yeah. I think, I mean, if you hear a lot of players talk about Arteta, they, a lot of them, you know, say that even the Man City players, they taught them a lot. You know, you, you hear other managers speak very highly of him as a coach. I think he's got something. And, um, you know, yes, I, I actually do think if you give him another year, this year is a massive year for him. To see where we finish at the end of this year is massive for him, I think, this year. Yeah. All right, Joseph, thanks for your call. Let's go to Femi, who's an Arsenal fan. Femi, good evening. Hey, hello, how are you? Yeah, we, I'm great. Me? I mean, watch the game tonight. Arsenal, all of a yeah. sudden, it's Arteta. Arteta's flying. Yeah, I, I, no, I'm just coming from the Emirates. So I'm in a queue waiting to go to the station. So, really good game tonight. Really impressed with the way the team played. And on Arteta, um, I was watching to stay. I was very patient and knew that it would get, um, get through this um, shit. I think we can get into top four is outside, but definitely top six if we keep on playing the way we're playing. Yeah, that, I mean, I, I, asked, yeah, I, I asked the question to a West Ham fan um, no, no, and an no. Arsenal fan as well earlier on in the show. I, I basically just said, West Ham are on 17 points in fourth place. Manchester United are having a bit of a nightmare at the minute. I know you sit 10th, but you're on 14 points. You're only three points off Champions League spot. I'm beating an eight as well. That's a correct. And there's a little mini league under the top three, really. You know, the likes of Manchester United, um, uh, um, West Ham, Arsenal, Everton. So it's that little mini league. Tottenham. Whoever comes does well. And Tottenham, yeah, Leicester and the likes. Whoever does well in that little mini league will finish in the top four, then top six. So if Arsenal can get there, or probably get there um, um, by way of the cup, winning the Carabao Cup, that would be a good result for Arsenal. Yeah. Mm. Um, just, just on Enketia, he's in his last year of his contract. He, he scored two tonight, Femi. Is he someone you want to stay at the football club? He's only 22. I'd love him to stay at Arsenal, but the thing is, it's just that um, if Lacazette does go, he, um, all, um, Enketia's in the last year of his contract as well. I think he's reluctant to, to stay. If things improve dramatically, he may stay, but I don't see it. Well, how important is the trophy for, for Arsenal, um, Fem? Would, would you take finishing outside that group, like you said, 6th, 7th, 8th, but winning this tournament? 
Oh, definitely. Winning a trophy and, and, and coming um, seventh or eighth, I know it's, it's, about, it's about trophies. Getting the trophy will get us into the Europa League. And then, you know, obviously, higher up the league, the better. But if we get a trophy, if we got a trophy in seventh place, I'd be happy. Um, but um, sixth place, um, without a trophy, I'd be just as happy. But, you know, as, as long as Arsenal keep on getting forward, Full place might be a, a stretch too far. It's very competitive, the Premier, Premier League, so it can be very difficult. But on the whole, I'm happy the way the things are going. All right, Femi, thanks for your call. Safe uh, journey. Hi.